Okay, what's up guys and welcome to a new game. We are going to be doing Fractal. And we'll go no tech trade immortal. Get into the swing of things a bit here. Haven't done these one of these no tech trade games in a while. Should be fun. Uh who to play? Who to play? Who to play? A lot of the guys I like I've already played recently. Zara. Let's do Zara. Yeah, tropical, why not? Lots of jungle. Could be fun. Could be horrible. Nice for a slower, no tech trade game though. Creative and organized, not bad traits. He's not a bad leader, maybe B tier, C tier, something like that. Mining is good, hunting is average, not great. Could be better. Um, creative helps a little bit with the early expansion, saving some hammers potentially. Really good for ocean fish. Um, cheaper libraries, and then organized. You get your civic upkeep discount and cheaper courthouses and lighthouses. It's not bad at all. Lots of hammer saving on this combo. Pretty cool. A bit like Marmot actually. Not as good though. Weaker starting text. So that's okay. Aromo is also a bit like the Janissary, except it's immune to first strikes, has a first strike, and then gets drill one and two. So it has a ton of first strikes. But it's still weak to knights and cuirassiers, so you will want to bring pikemen or elephants if you're going to attack with these guys. Otherwise, they're pretty darn good against everything else, um, and they can be pretty crazy when you go to drill four for sure. Uh, the monument thing is a monument with 25% culture. It's a big whoop-de-do, really. Okay, one of these starts, that's okay. I'd like to go on the Plains Hill. Don't know about moving south toward the tundra though. We got jungle right here. Um, a warrior can't really check for much. Could go left and check these two hills or I could go right and check this, but I think what I want to do is just go here. Toward the river and on the plains hill and get whatever that is. Keep my two good tiles here. Yeah, um, okay bro. Sure, but let's... Check here, I guess. Nothing. Alright, I'm gonna go on the plains hill, I think. Got wine. No Mansa. Um, okay. Yeah, Plain Seal, very important for early game production. Not the best kind of capital ever, though. The food is a bit. Yikers. Um, we won't be sharing that corn around, that's for sure. We have some green tiles, I suppose. The commerce could be better. I've got the wines, I guess. Yeah, it's alright, but I'm going to need to actually like grow these cottages up to make them worth it. Get printing press and stuff. Right, we start with the scout too. Interesting. Spice. Ah, there's the grassy stuff. Now, obviously, we want agriculture first here, but we'll wait five turns to decide. We can also switch to this in a minute to get an extra commerce. I'm going to go agriculture first, farm that, farm the wine. 2 1 2. It's actually pretty decent early game yield as opposed to a crappy forest. Good early commerce from doing that without giving up food. I like that. A bit better than a lake because it has the hammer. And that'll get us to bronze working, then we'll put some mines down. 
Um, the long-term commerce is not great unless we like mass cottage some of this green stuff. We'll see about that. So it's yeah, agriculture for sure. Hey, okay, we got dye all the way down here. Yeah. Oh god, that's yeah. Guess who's next to us? Ah, <laughs> uh, that is wonderful. That is absolutely wonderful. Well, peace is not gonna last. A very long time, guys. We got a vision on his capital, which is kind of interesting. I want to go like over here somewhere with my second city. Like I don't know. Go here with creative. I doubt it would be able to get the corn off me. Um, we're gonna abuse creative and stuff. Something like that. We'll check this spot out a bit more. Oh, not you again. God. Man, I've got all the bastards with me. What the hell is this map? Who else are we gonna get? Suri as well? Why not, dude? <laughs> Wonderful. Well, get a discount on agriculture. It's only four more turns. Um, because these jackasses both start with it. Oh, yeah, sure. Okay, dude, you've just got all the stuff here, apparently. Well, he'll go that way, surely, instead of towards me. Surely. Oh, farmers, pray that your summers be wet and your winters clear. Why not? Nothing's lost. This will be good to irrigate this way later on in the game, I suppose. Like, farm here and here for a city up there to get the dye, maybe? I don't know. Something like that. We're gonna need a lot of farms. Well, okay, we have something here too. That's, that's kind of nice, actually. I believe I started on this tile and I moved south here. Yeah. No tech trading. Um, how do I attack this guy? Flatland capital. Guess we see what bronze working reveals. Could horse archer rush. Like, it's not the dumbest idea ever with how close he is. I don't care if he has MPs. So, seven turns until thingy. But we're gonna farm this while we wait, which will take five, six turns. It should be perfect, actually. Perfectly in line. Stupid lion, Eve. I should have a 90% chance to win that. Jesus. Oh, that's messed up. He's gonna steal my corn. Oh my freaking god, dude. Just can't have nice things. Okay, I might go here, actually. Shaka didn't settle yet. I assume he's going to get that nice spot, though. Over there, with everything in it. Gilgamesh just did the bastardness. Took my corn. That's super close. Prick. Might mean he's got nowhere else to go and he's crammed in a corner down there because there's water here and then there's water here. Like he might just be on a little peninsula. So if I go like up here, I can just block the prick. First things first, I want that wet corn though. 
It's a bloody good tile. You go see what Giggles is up to. Okay, we need a chop and then a chop and a mine, maybe? No, just a chop and a mine. And that'll get the settler out, essentially. And we can go there and do that. Yeah, because this is going to take like eight turns. It is entirely seamless. Bang on time. Man killed in battle. To lie Commerce is good though, steel. which is nice. In his death, we can nine turn animal husbandry, that's fair. not too shabby at all. A good old men to know. Yeah, dude. Yeah, you enjoy your corny prick. Yeah, he's boxed in a corner, it's looking like. So he's going to come after us. Meanwhile, Shaka's probably got tons of land. If I can control Shaka, we can also get Gilgamesh. I don't know, man. I might have to 1v2 here. Wanted a nice, relaxing, immortal game, but it doesn't look like I'm getting one of those, does it? <laughs> we have lots of forests, though. That's great if we can find horse. Now, we didn't get copper, so maybe that's horse right there. Who knows, dude? Oh, I spoke too soon. Right there. Or actually, just right there. Hopefully his third doesn't go up there. I want this first before anything. True. Go look down there. I don't know, I, mean, I need to wait two turns. I've got to go here, then I've got to settle. Actually, I'm just going to go straight for another Settler and try and get that spot before Giggles. Blessed and he's going up there to check cattle, out the increase of thoughts. Time, okay. Flocks of thy sheep. Cool. Horse Archer Rush is on the cards. Still don't know if we want it to be Shaka or Giggles. Lots of happiness down here, it's kind of nice actually. Go on that hill there, get the one fur here. Organised, making me only pay two gold. Always good. So what? We go wheel pottery or what? We're not expansive. We are creative. We could go like early writing and open borders with the jerk off. No, I need wheel to road into him though. Get a really early scientist and bold math for my horse archer rush though. That's a thing. Wheel writing pottery. I'm gonna need you to go work first because you're already getting a settler. We don't have time to. Well, we could grow and whip actually. That might be faster when the food comes online, to be fair. Uh, yeah, okay, let's grow and whip. I also sh really should have done this earlier. I'll just do it now. He's definitely checking it out up there. There's lots of spots down here. I need to get this. Oh shit. Okay, well, I'll let Gilgamesh deal with that. That's okay. Go up there, Gigglemesh. See what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up there, dude. No, you're going the wrong way. Well, your scout's freaking dead, bro. <laughs> Maybe a mine in here. Pump out a worker like that. Could be a thing, too. Not sure what he's doing. He's not expanding. Put your shoulder to the wheel. So I'm gonna take advantage of that and cut him off right now. This is the big difference between Immortal and Deity. You can get so much more early land on Immortal than you can. When they start with two freaking settlers and then get their third settler at 3000 BC, you get really screwed, but this is much more chill. 
and we can do some chilling here. Should probably go right. Whatever, we'll get the mine done. It's not a bad thing to have at all. It's on a good tile as well with the commerce. Alright, still get it in three. That's good. Get some warriors out. That is a three food tile later on. I think like right here, let's still get the copper. Let's do that. Don't steal the corn, dude. Just do that, it's okay, bro. It's okay. I need this capital to hit size four, so... We just can't go around stealing people's corn like that, you know? <laughs> Try to understand. Stonehenge. Yeah, we've blocked Gilgamesh off. I want one here. Work the horses, the sheep, and the fur. That's nice. And maybe two grassland mines. Be a really good city later on. Or one grassland mine, I don't know. Um, and we've got one here with fur and crap. Oh, this is not bad. I like it when there's actually like stuff in the tundra. It's very interesting. When there's nothing in the tundra, it kind of sucks balls. <laughs> Let's be real. Big commitment doing writing before pottery, but it might be good. Um, I never cowed the cow. Let's get the cow then. While well, we've got nothing better to do, we could ride this, but it's we can do that after the cow. The cow will help this city do stuff too. Early library, get a scientist so we can math it up. Sounds good. You're just chilling there. Hopefully Shaka gets the Barbarians, not me. One more worker I'm thinking here. You can start on a barracks. We'll think about that warrior. Might be a lot of land up there. Someone's getting horse archer rushed though, that's for sure. Does he have any units yet? No. Does he have anything dangerous yet? Any impies, dude? No. Okay, give me one sec. Okay. Um... I think I will get this warrior out, and what I'm gonna do is send this guy over and scout Gilgamesh out. We're getting riding in five turns. I want to see what Gilgamesh's capital looks like. We're gonna rush whoever's got the best capital, because that's obviously the best for us. Um, looks like we may have cut Gilgamesh off. I don't know if he's gonna try to squeeze in here. It's not going to do him much good though, he won't get the horses. Especially if I settle that. Um, yeah, we have one worker so we're catching up and getting three workers. And then we'll go for another settler. We could just do a settler here too. Not even that bad at 12 turns. Could try growing. Working both mines maybe. Oh, there's more spots in the north. The 
Looks like Shaka's taking out the barbs for us. We well, might as well just wipe this mine. Like, it's one turn slower to grow, but it's just so much better. I mean, we could road into the idiots and just open borders. Direct path to his capital, especially if he actually chops that. That'll be quite nice. Yeah, we'll road into him for some easy trade routes. Great wall. None of these guys built that. Oh, wow, that's a killer spot. Okay, I kind of need that. Can't probably get out many more units, so otherwise I'm going to pay a lot of money. Go here and see what Shaka's up to. I might have to delete dudes if that cost me, that worry didn't cost me. But yeah. Definitely nice land up there, no doubt about that. We're gonna road our stuff up here, just these three tiles here. So we're getting trade routes from Shaka in a sec. So we've got. Why did my research. Oh, I see why. Because of that. Alright, yeah, we need to wipe the commerce, bro. Okay, go on the road, because it's going to be faster in a sec. Okay, we can finish this. Definitely, definitely want that. Um, go for it now, that warrior can wait. Don't have to attack them straight away. Um, we'll be able to see if they plot. I'm sure they met each other. Yeah, they did, and they of course they like each other. Shaka's expanding. True glory consists in doing what deserves to be written. go toward me. In writing what deserves to be read. We might have really cut Gilgamesh off. It doesn't look like he's doing anything. Let's open borders before he gets pissy at us about close borders. Just got a million archers, but that's that's nothing. Oh wow! Wow, this is the good stuff. Maybe I'll go here, dude, if I'm gonna attack him. The fish will be nice. I think we gotta go pottery first to get granaries. I don't know, maybe our commerce will be good, it doesn't matter. Let's go explore. Scouting is very important in a situation like this. Let's get one of these up and running. Since we're not doing it in the capital, maybe we just do it here then. Yeah, it's kind of supposed to do that in the capital, but maybe here we'll be fine. Grow to size 4, work a mine and two scientists. Maybe it wouldn't be too bad, eh? Not sure about the fishing first thing. Update. Hold on. Finish the road. Now we update this. Should boost our research. Yeah. Hells yeah. Oh, he's got ivory, that's spooky. Hmm. Getting a library will give me a lot of culture, I'll be able to keep these tiles and have a yeah, dude, just freaking six war sarches, crush a Lundi. <laughs> so easy if I have this tile. That's the power of creative right there. 
알렌디 It's the Zara hype music It's not wasting any time on the expansion, that's for sure I really want some of that, man, I want to go here I want to go here. Uh, you, you better not ruin this fish shark. I'm watching you. I mean, I can go here if he goes there. Well, maybe I go there and then here after. Oh my god, these two spots are freaking insane. Yeah, but he'll kick my ass. So much nice stuff. It's hard to grab it all for sure. Can't cottage yet, we're going fishing like an idiot. Chuck that away, we don't want him putting units in there, man. The good old Mendeno says we should hook up the copper. What do you think? I think it's a great idea. He did get a third one, but was it down, was it this piece of crap down here? I wonder what he's doing. Okay, I want you to grow. In three. And you're gonna take the chop, and you're gonna get this chop in three. Should work out that way. Um, 20 hammers, it's 40. I might need to work a forest for a couple turns. Where did he go with the setup? Okay, he's gone. Oh, no, you don't. You bastard. Oh, you bastard. Stay away from my stuff. Yeah, Gilgamesh is cramped. Okay, save two turns with that chop, that's nice. Let's go pottery now. Library will be done in a sec. We can swap to a commerce next turn, actually. I don't need your cows, bro. As long as I get this, this one here, I'll, or this one at the very least, I'll be okay. Shaka's settling everything on the front land. I don't know what Gilgamesh is gonna do if he doesn't have any metal though. Yeah, it's a war between Shaka and myself. We get pottery and then we just go straight to horseback riding. We're gonna start on the scientists next turn, dude, and bulb math, boost our chops, and then just pump horse archers. And then we can have a freaking Sim City style building game once we take out these two jackasses. Can't leave these guys alive, man, but you never know when they're gonna stick the knife in the back. This culture's, yeah, gonna fix him here. He'll never get this tile back. <laughs> we can go pottery right now, though, that's excellent. Yeah, the early game. This little farm on the wine has come a long way, dude. It's been really helping me. Tell you that right now. Be dum be dum bum be We do want cottages. Um, until then, though, we might just do some roading. Doesn't seem like the worst thing ever. Could pre chop. I could chop a library in here. Oh, this warrior. We'll get him out next turn. Okay, oh, okay, I can work with that. That's totally cool, bro. Thanks for understanding. Okay, this city here will have to build the boat itself using the copper. You can take the copper and get that worker one turn faster. You're gonna now just pump 17 turns. But that's enough. 
That's how long this will probably take me, right? Yeah. Something like that. Look at this. Three cities. I'm only paying five gold. Organized. Let's go. I'm telling you, dude. This trait is so underrated. It's usually like six or seven, but no. Five. That's... That's nice, bro. That's really nice. <laughs> Numberless arches. Arches. Yeah, that's nice. Um, let's do the library thing in here. We're gonna chop out one as well, and we're gonna just, like... Go here and connect the horses, maybe. Okay, I want a road here, and I want a road here. So when I build units, they can go 1, 2, 3, 4, and then not get screwed by the river. I want a cottage, but that'll have to wait. Let's road that first. Get our roads up nice and early, maybe. Hallelujah, yeah. Yeah, he's crammed. Oh, he got screwed. He should not even be on this continent, dude. This should be my territory, but this is what fractal maps can do to a guy, man. Completely screw you up. Now, if he's got iron, we're obviously going to have issues. Um, yeah, and he settled here, so he will... Well, he can still go here if he really wants. If he's a prick, he might try to go there. I'm expecting him to take this tile, but I'm not too concerned about that. I want to chop something so I can put it into the thingamajiggy. The, uh, widgimajiggy. The, um, 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 library. I believe that's more important than the granary, especially because creative and stuff. Just figuring out which tile I want to chop. So I could, like, chop here and go to the horses. I could chop here. And then put a mine. I'm not going to be running scientists in the capital. I'm going to build another settler. So maybe the mine makes sense. Yeah, let's do that. Shaka's expanding really fast for Immortal AI. Like, really, really fast. You don't see Immortal AI go that nuts. Really, ever. Kudos to him, I suppose. He's playing the game pretty well. Yeah, man, poor Gilgamesh. I had a feeling about that, just with the water here. The water here and the fact it came straight in my face. Yeah, that's... Sucks to be you, bro. Man, I don't even, like, need to chop. I've come to realise. Uh, it'll go into another settler, though. May as well. I should have, like, put a cottage down. I really don't think we're going to do a whole lot of whipping in this horse archer rush. So mines, especially since the mines are like on the river tiles and stuff, I'm really thinking mines are the play because we don't want to whip. We have a very low happy cap and we have no bonus happy resources until after we take Shaka. Okay, I have fur, so I could whip a little bit. Maybe in the double food city, for example, that's going to be really good to whip there, but... These cities, especially my capital, I don't think I'm going to whip much at all. Because, yeah. Now, I think I want some cottages. We have to think about irrigating this though, so we might want to farm, farm, farm. But I do want some kind of cottage, just so Lalabella has something to work. I could also just chop this forest here to get a boat. Actually, that's probably the play. Let's do that. I'm going to have five hammers working the copper and that. So yeah, we chop the boat out. Already on horseback. Shouldn't be too long. Do I want a cottage here? Like, I could grow to size five, provided I get the freaking fertile. Which might not actually happen. So, maybe it will, but... No, cottaging that is not the play right now. Because we're not going to work it, probably. We want the mine and stuff. Let's just use our beautiful mine there. Let's chop in here, though. I think we should try to grow the capital to size 5. Like, grow to the happy cap, for sure. You're going here. Shaka found iron. That's not... 
ideal. Damn. Um. Yeah, well, whatever. I don't think I need that dude. It's pointless. Because I have so many. Like, you can go there, you can go there. I have plenty of warriors already. I've one in each city, a scout, and one in Gilgamesh's territory. We're already paying. Yeah, nah, we're not making any more warriors. We're gonna chop this for that city, not this one. Okay, I don't think we can make contact with any other continents. I'm not seeing any sus tiles. Um. So Shaka's already gone iron working, and the reason he did that is because he's got. Oh god, he's got gold here. We definitely want to kill Shaka. If Gilgamesh attacks us, that would suck, but... With horse archers and stuff, we should be able to defend. Now, what we need to do is get our horses up and running. Um, I want that library first. I could... No, that's not going to work. Yeah, we got we, we got to chop here to get the settler out. Maybe chop even a little bit more. Might even put a cottage or two down. A shareable cottage? Yeah, I'm not feeling it. The plains tiles. Just a little bit of cottaging. It's good I got another worker though. We're vibing here. Lala Bella could really use a cottage somewhere. We might farm that one. Just like a line of farms north. And then this one and then this one can be cottaged. Maybe something like that'll work. I want cottages just to, yeah, to have something to work. It would be nice. We could also farm that to give this guy more food. But I think. With these two tiles and then mines, this will be pretty strong still. Definitely gonna hurt the economy a tiny bit. But we are organized, we pay less money for these guys, and we're gonna get the fish in a couple turns. The city should pay for itself. Is it connected? No, but it should automatically connect once the borders pop. I think. Otherwise we can just get a road to the copper and then north of the copper. That's not too hard to do. We also want a road into Gilgamesh just so we can have some money. I'm gonna keep checking for him to find metal. Man, if he's got no metal. Makes him an easy target, but I still target Shaka first. Shaka's the one. That we definitely want to go for. Just wondering if I have time to do this. I could also just like... not mine it and give that guy the food in Lalabella instead. We don't have to th do that right now. What we could do is just chop the settler and then get the horses. Workboat for La Addis Ababa. One turn, perfect amount of hammers. That was well planned. Excellent. Go me. We've definitely pushed our expenses up a bit, but should be okay now with the addition of that. Ooh, that's not gonna work. That cottage, because I need to grow. You know what? We're building a settler. Why am I not just doing this if I'm building a settler? Okay, there's only one turn I wasted, but... This is the same when you're building a settler, so this city could really use the growth right now, so I can actually work that cottage in a minute. Could have grown one turn faster if I did that earlier, but that's just a minor thing. Now, we don't have to improve this straight away. We're going to take this, maybe. So what I'm thinking is... We do the road thing. We don't need any more warriors, we know that. So let's just start 
booking up the metal and stuff. Okay, I need about 90 gold to get there, which is not great, but doable. Yeah, we'll do that. Might make the difference here. Actually, it won't. But hammers are good, I suppose. Or are they really that important? Are the hammers really that important? Maybe they're not. I'm gonna finish in three turns regardless. The good old Menden No says you should go there. Okay, well, we've looked at everything here. We'll be able to see if he gets metal. We're gonna watch Shaka. Shaka's putting all his points on me, the little punk. Yeah, Lundy's looking pretty hot to take, though. Um, rather than Cottage right now, actually, we should just, like, think about our next city. Finish that, I suppose. Um, we, we're going here, number five. Get this and this. We should definitely be thinking about that one. How am I gonna settle that? Am I gonna road that? Well, we're gonna have roads here. No, I should, like, road... Where I'm settling it here. I want the units to... I should really, like, road these two tiles so it's, like, connected that way. The fastest way to get to Shaka is like that. And I'm gonna need a road on this tile anyway, so yeah. We'll just do the road thing. You can hook up... No, you're shopping, that's right. And then you can go hook up the sheep or something. Gilgamesh is just stuck. He's stuck. That's unlucky to be Gilgamesh. Road that to, could road that to get the city one turn faster. I need to actually road all this to hook up the horse anyway. Let's do that to get the city down one turn faster. That's fine. We'll come back and finish the cottage. I think the food is more important now. Oh, shaka, that sucks, dude. That's what you get when you forward settle people. You get forward barbarian. Definitely has like impian stuff in up, that's okay. Do that for relations, I don't think we need the health. Yeah, this is an interesting one. Definitely. We've blocked off Gilgamesh though, that's important. Connect the good old men to no, and we're gonna go here. Finish that road. No, we should just get in position for the sheep and finish the road after. To be completely honest. And we could chop the granary. And then do the horses after, maybe. Um, excuse me, you need to go there. Okay, what are we doing here? This is... Not great, but yeah, get the granary up. It doesn't really matter either way. Then 
we have a pre-cottage here. That will be worked next turn. Should be okay to get there in a few turns. This gives us happiness, a key, very important. get me another worker really quickly. Do you really need this tile? I don't think you do. I think you could benefit from that more. I'm getting horseback riding, but I need to freaking get <laughs> the horses, dude. Sorry, we're yeehawing the horses real quick. Barracks. Right, we're not really. Commerce is not actually an issue at the moment. Let's actually get the buildings built. We're fast. 1100 BC horseback is quite decent. We're going to have a math bulb, so our production is going to be absolutely insane. Do that so I can build a stable here, maybe. If you speak the truth, have a foot in the spirit. Definitely one here. Maybe I don't need one here, just build metal dudes instead. turn we can take that maybe. Math bulb is coming up. Archery. He hasn't researched mysticism yet. Need a road in oh Samaria's a problem now, potentially. Okay. No, you bastard. More forests. Wait, I was roading that tile though, that's not cool. Guess we're chopping it. grow until I get the squirrels up, so three hammers is better for now. If in other sciences we should arrive at certainty without doubt and truth without error, it leaves us to place the foundations of knowledge in mathematics. The good old Mendon No says you really need to like stop growing. Um, yeah, this is an issue. Okay, well, we actually want to grow here. Good old Mendon No says we actually just don't have enough workers. Really? Ah, oh, five. Yeah, five is 
Well, it's kind of not enough since I need to like chop as well. I don't know, man. I think another worker is in order. I think I should grow and whip though first. Yeah, grow first and we'll whip a worker at size 4 or the granary into a worker or something like that. Or oh, not you. Well, we got that one turn faster. Let's do that. Okay, we have the horses. Right on time. Yeah, just do that for now. Capital can have the food. We could always whip in here if we need to. Someone will be getting whipped, that's for sure. Would like the fur. That's a lot of work turns. I don't know, man. Even happiness is kind of production and it would save me forests if I just got happiness instead. That's another spot I want to settle. Still got my path to Shaka's capital, dude. suppose. Do not throw the arrow which will return against you. Well, you know what? I need a mine in here. So I didn't want to whip this place. I'll mine that one. It's gonna take me some time to get ready. It won't be the fastest horse archer rush ever. But we can start pumping quite a bit of dudes out. Shop these forests near Gilgamesh so he can't put his pricks in there. I don't trust that guy. He's a prick himself. Oh, wow. Creative freaking gonna be insane down there yeah we might just whip the capital and I'll whip one of those and then everyone else just works mines I'm going to hook up the fur so that unhappiness won't be an issue. This is going to take freaking forever though. We'll get this worker to help. Eventually. Maybe chop the stuff on the way. I need to road that actually. When I attack Shaka, we're not going to get any trade routes. Pump out the dudes. Been a while since I've done one of these, hasn't it, guys? Long time. A few months. This will be fun. If it's not a disaster. This is the best way to kill your neighbor, though. Is to horse archer and joy. Yeah, the unhappiness is unfortunate, but the tiles I was working were really crap. Ten dudes should sort that out. It's gonna be ten dudes because there's got a big stack in there, but we can get ten guys, that's okay. We've got five cities pumping out guys, it can't be that hard. Some of them have granaries. 
Might need defense up here. Are these guys doing anything? No, I have the most stupidest caveman neighbors ever. this fur, the happiness will be good, then I can keep whipping some of the cities. That built a granary. What if we did like that? Gave you the food. Would we want to whip him here? No, not really. We don't want to whip this guy. No, 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 no. I don't like that. Just do that. Hey, we got this tile up though, that's nice. It's a good tile. Okay, we actually get that in three turns now. Another mine in here, that's nice. Pumping guys out now. Yeah, we are pumping. Chop that away. Don't need Shaka going in there, that's for sure. Still unhappy, like, we may as well just hold off for a sec. We could grow this, because we are getting the stuff. In which case I could consider another cottage, maybe. It's a thought. I want to get, yeah, I should get this guy out. Archer wouldn't be bad either. Spear, Archer, I don't know, we'll just chop. We have so many forests, this is the best way to use these forests, just to kill these guys. I mean, yeah, they're not attacking me, but that's... I only last for so long <laughs> with these kind of neighbors. I think we have enough food in here for the early game just by sharing stuff with the capital, so I'm going to go ahead and cottage this one. And we could consider whipping in here. Maybe a chariot for a medic. Take out easy axemen as well. We need to whip barracks here. Just to get dudes out, bro. We can bring the axe and spear though, because, well, if we fail, we can bring them. It's a little bit of backup. It's quite unfortunate, I might need a road. I don't know. Eight of his power. It's not bad. It is Shaka after all. That's a lot of his dudes in there. Just a few more guys. Yeah, we should be good around 500 BC. Need to irrigate over here somehow. That'll need to be farmed. A little more food and yeehaw would really make it yeehaw. Want a mine for this guy to work at size 4? We have the workers. The math chops in a horse archer rush though, dude. How good is it? Fucking amazing. Really helping me pump right now, that math bulb. I think we'll work on another dude here for like an academy or something. Something long term. Might not even build units. I don't know. Might just like 
go to library and run dudes in here because I don't know. I need to keep tacking. We are on no tech trade. I'm sure these guys are doing stuff. I've cavemaned it for quite a while now. Don't want to accidentally bump into freaking feudalism or something stupid. That's another one for you to work. Could also just whip this guy. Get tons of overflow from doing that. Really bad. Okay, I'm gonna take a break here right before my rush starts. There's too much noise in the background anyway. I'll see you guys soon.